Where's the poop, Robin? Excuse me? When I was a kid, I had a dog named Bean. Whenever he made the face that you're making right now, you just knew he pooped somewhere in the house. Where's the poop, Robin? I don't know what you're talking about. Where's the poop, Robin? There's no poop. Where's the poop? Okay. So it wasn't entirely a peaceful moment of closure. Hey, Don, here's some breaking news. There's a zit breaking out on your forehead. <laughs> Finished with that. I'm not proud, but Dawn left so quickly that I never got the chance to have that final showdown. So yelling at him, even on TV, felt kind of good. And you know what? Now I truly am over him. That's great. Thank you. Good on you. Where's the poop, Robin? Damn it! <laughs> OK, in the process of truly getting over him, I may have called him and left an indelicate voicemail. I am going to kill you. I'm gonna fly to Chicago, kill you, put your stupid face on a deep dish pizza, and eat it. And then maybe catch a Bears game. But mostly the killing and eating your face thing. Give me your phone. We're deleting Don's number. Hey, Lily. Don't hey, Lily me. I smelled poop all the way from the hallway. <sighs> no, not this again. Where's the poop, Robin? Okay, I left on another message. <gasps> this just in is what I'm gonna say when I'm stabbing you. But that's impossible. You deleted his number. I tried to, but then this thing popped up on my phone that said, are you sure? And I wasn't sure. I can't lie to my phone. Hey, guys. Where's the poop, Robin? How do you do that? You are like a bomb-sniffing dog, except with poop. You're a poop-sniffing dog. I think that's just called a dog. <laughs> Where's the poop, Robin? <sighs> Fine, I called Dawn again. Hey, Dawn, it's Robin again. Uh, look, I am sorry for all the calls. It's just, I saw you on the news and it made me a little crazy for a minute. <laughs> I guess I wasn't as over our breakup as I thought. Um, but I wanna say from the bottom of my heart, I am gonna kill you. Nope, <laughs> no, I'm not. <laughs> I am happy for you. <laughs> and that Asian slut on your Facebook page, she's dead too. <laughs> I thought you deleted his number. I did, but it turns out I memorized it. You can't delete contacts from your brain, Lily. Well, you have to try if you ever want to have closure. I am never going to have closure. OK, closure doesn't exist. OK, one day, Don and I are moving in together, and the next thing I know, he's on a plane to Chicago. And just end it. And no matter how much I try to forget that it happened, it will have never not happened. Like, Don and I will always be a loose end will always be unfinished. Gowdy, to his credit, never gave up on his dream, but that's not usually how it goes. I mean, usually it isn't a speeding bus that keeps the brown, pointy, weird church from getting built. Most of the time, it's just too difficult, or too expensive, or too scary. It's only once you've stopped that you realize how hard it is to start again. So you force yourself not to want it. But it's always there. And until you finish it, it will always be. And now, the 11 o'clock news with Don Frank. Bueno? Uh, who is this? No hablo inglés. ¿Quién es? I'm sorry, is this 917456? I'm sorry, uh, 465. No, wait. Huh. Robin finally got some closure, too. Sorry, wrong number. Finished with that. <laughs>